welcome to another edition of Beer Dads, me reviews with me, David the Beer Dads. Gonna do another beer review. Gonna do a Gypsy Hill beer, and I'm gonna do their nonsensical New England IPA, rated at 5.5%. There it is, it says so right there. Um, not sure about the can art on this, whether it's an evangelist or just a lecturer. Anyway, there you go, typical sort of Gypsy Hill style. Um, we have got packaged on 24th of the 6th, 19, best before 21st of December 19. It says so there. Cost £4 out of the mighty Bartons in Ashton Makefield. So, quite like Gypsy Hill beers, if I'm being honest. So it says here, it nonsensical is a human IPA, fermented in our house, kiva yeast, which kicks, our house kiva yeast, which kicks out boatloads of orange, uh, orange peel esters, and is being highly hopped uh, with Idaho 7, Raku, and the clubhouse favourite Citra, with a big pungent fruits, tropical notes, and citrus peel. Goes well with expats and the coffee culture, it says there. And the obligatory drink fresh, and all that rubbish. So, let's pop it off. Let's see what we've got going on. Let's get into a glass. Okay, so beer in a glass. What are we looking at? We've got ourselves a very cloudy orange juice looking type beer. It looks like a cordial into two fingers of head. Got a bit of a bit of a wobble on it. Like a set egg custard. A couple of floaters across the bottom. Picking them up. Yeah, you can see them. Alright, so <clears throat> looks okay. Let's see what we've got in the old uh, the old nose. <sighs> Loads of orange. There is tropical fruit there. There's mango. There's a bit of papaya. Hints hints of passion fruit. Let's go for the body of the carb. Medium bodied. It starts off with a bit in your mouth. Do you think it's going to be a little bit velvety? It feels medium. Then it kind of washes itself away. It's actually a medium to light body. Carbonation is short, a little bit vigorous, but it works well with the body. Okay, big old gobble. Here we go. It's actually quite nice. Starts off relatively sweet. Um, doesn't hang around, the sweetness does just, just fade. Fruity comes in. You get a little bit of tropical, you get a little bit of mango, ripe mango, stone fruits, apricots, and peaches, that type of stuff. That dies. Then it leaves room for the citrus to come in. That does leave you with an orange peel, tangerine peel, orange citrus fruit peel into the back end. It's not bad. There's a dryness building up on it. After a couple of mouthfuls, it starts to you start to get it. It kind of just lays itself. All in all, for a five point five percent New England IPA, bear in mind the New England IPAs I'm drinking up to can sixes, sevens, eights. It's really good. It's nice. Does leave the inside of the roof about is a bit, a bit dry. Again, not a bad thing. This is not this is not bad for, for the gypsy ale beer. A lot of this stuff. It's a bit hit miss to be fair. I've got another one here. I've got a one called Ballyhoo, which is done a collab with Cult with Cloudwater. I'm looking forward to doing that. <laughs> uh, but this is all right. They've made better new IPAs than this one, uh, but obviously with a higher higher ABV. Um, but yeah, it's not a, it's not a bad little drop, I must say. So there you go. 
So a little cheeky little five minute review. Gypsy Hills, nonsensical given the IPA, 5.5%. Do I like it? Yes, I do. Would I buy it again? Probably not because they make better stuff than this. I um, would I recommend it to friends. Yes, yes, I would. I think if you, you want to sort of uh, sit outside, hot sunny day, sticking with friends, and you want something a bit like this, New England IPA style, then this is probably going to be around about what you should be going for. If you want something a bit more punch, then you can go to Tesco, you can buy our stuff in Tesco for, for, for three pounds or four, and you get a lot more for your buck, to be fair, a bit more bang. So, there you go. But would I recommend to friends? Yes, I would. So, if you've had nonsensical, let me know what you think. Put a comment below. We a link to the Gypsy Hill uh, Brewer website also below. If you like the video, do that. If you like the video, do that. Subscribe down there. I'll see you in the next one. Hail Yale.